Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes, right? And then I'm gonna start to count to a hundred, okay? And then you guys hide. Everybody got it? It's hide and seek, Vernon, not hide and calculus. We've all got it. I got it. You start counting, and then I go hide in that bush. Great. What? Milka, you're a genius. Come on, Dogan. Hold on. This reminds me of a story. It's about counting. Hello? Man, you guys are good. Oh, cool. Invisibility. <laughs> um, hello, this is Iron Mark III. And welcome back to Psychonauts. I was feeling a bit insane, so, you know. Nothing says insane like... Insane? Oh man, that's, that's pretty fast, that. How do I pick these up again? Oh yeah, F. Wait. I was feeling insane, insane, so I thought, hey, let's go on Psychonauts. No, that's not respawn, it's just the arrowheads that do. Okay. Let's see if I can remember how to freaking pick them up. Never mind. I've forgotten how to interact with even the most simple things in this game, so, you know. This is all going to bode well. No, that's first person, okay. On sale now in the main store, we have a special on Dream Fluffs. You hear me? Dream Fluffs! They're good for you. Keep a pocket full of these for a quick boost of mental health. Mental health? That sounds like something I could go for. Okay, it is F. I'm just standing in the wrong place. Right. Now. Last time I was on here, I... Ooh, that's a shiny grate. Too bad I have no idea where it goes. Last time, I just finished basic braining, and it's time to go to the main no campgrounds. Passing, oh, hello. But I need to get to Sasha 9's secret lab. Maybe you should have thought of that before. I did think of that before. That's why I'm here now. Exactly. Now you gotta pay the toll. One arrowhead. Pay up. I found this thing. Is that what you're talking about? Yep. That's an arrowhead. <laughs> How'd they get here? Frankie, the new kid can't be this dumb, right? The camp's built on an Indian burial ground and... Oh my gosh! Indians buried their dead here? Ew! I hope not. No, stupid. They buried their arrowheads here. They're hidden underground, but they let out a little gas once in a while. Just like Coach Oleander. So if you see any of that stuff, just pull them right out. Like truffles. Anyway, let me have one of yours. Oh, fine. Here you go. Blooming extortionists. I also liked the meta there of how um, during the cutscene he actually pointed at my arrow indicator when asking if that's what it was. <laughs> I didn't spot that before. Whoa there, you. Come oh, here, hello. you. Can't do the scavenger hunt without a list. Report back to me when you have enough items for your first promotion. Now get! Hey, scavenger hunt. Find things. Also, hello, old guy who talked to me my first night here. Nice to see you again. So where do I... Hey, where'd he go? Yeah, he's also gone, so... How does that old guy get around so fast? <laughs> Oh, hello there. You, new boy. Seen bear lurking in woods? Nope. Was it you? Giant, hairless bear? Nope. In Russia, bears much smaller. Also more hair. Less lurking. Always eager to wrestle. This one, hide and run. I'll let you know if I see anything. Cannot lurk forever, bear. I think he's from Russia. The accent gave it away, really. Yeah, that's... A pink hairless bear in the woods. Ooh, card. Grab the card, grab the card. And an arrowhead. Why not? Don't worry, I'm still planning to cut out a lot of stuff here. But, um... First things first. This is something that tutorials never actually told me. Which is how to get stuff out of my backpack to ask people with them and stuff like that. this button from Sasha 9 and I have to give it back. Do you know where a secret lab is? Do not know. 
Why not ask Foxy girlfriend over there? Again with the girlfriend. Listen. Hey, just kidding. Mikhail no woman good for only one thing. Wrestling. Unless you have skinny arms, like your girlfriend. Then, out of luck. Then they're not leaving that alone, are they? No. Um I might have just missed it to be honest, but the tutorial did not include how to access things from the inventory. So when I played through this a little bit before I started recording it, I got completely and utterly stumped by this part for like. Okay, call me crazy, nope. but I have just got to sell more side course today. So yes, these prices are real. Here at the camp store, side cores are just that cheap today. They're, they're still really expensive. But yeah, I, I, I put away the button and I couldn't ask about it, so I got completely lost for about an hour or so. Just as you do. If you were going to make a friendship bracelet, you could maybe use this button here. Why? So you could unbutton it and take it off when you got tired of being friends with me? Who said you were making it for me? Uh... You know, if you were going to shut up, you could use that button on your lip. How about that? Jeez. What's this about friendship bracelets? Let, let, let me put this thing away. Hey, Lily. Do you know where Sasha 9's secret lab is? Secret? It's printed on your map. Duh. Oh, I knew that. I was just curious if you knew where Sasha 9's lab was. Because I do. Uh-huh. Wait, I have a map? Map, 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 map. Here we go, map. Okay. Over there. Oh yeah, that's also something that confused me as well. But... Hmm. Quit mumbling, darn it. There's those two girls. I don't want to go near them. In case they take me an another arrow head off me. Uh, no, it's not that way. It's this way. Stuff at the store is also really pricey, so keep your mind and campgrounds clean. Oh. Or else get a rake in your ear. Ranger Crow. Wait, how many of these do I actually have? Thirteen. Okay. That's enough for a course, so I can go in and grab that. Let's do that. Because to be honest, the prices in the store are pretty high, regardless. So there's not much that can be done without some running around harvesting arrowheads and stuff. Also, he's the local cop. Excuse me. I told you the burgers ain't ready. Uh, no, you didn't. The coals ain't hot. They're not going to be done for a while. They're maybe a week. A week? They're back ordered. I'm the only one back here. These things take time. I don't even want a hamburger. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? So, what do you want? Oh, that's my last cobweb duster. Take that into someone's mind with you. You can clean up. They're happy to be rid of the webs. And you can turn them in for Psy cards. Yeah, see what I mean? 800 for this thing. Rank 20 as well, so be a while. Now with that, you can change the color of some of your Psy powers. Like your levitation ball and what have you and what not. Well, kind of a vanity thing. You know, in my day, side powers were all grey, and we thought that was grand. We were happy just to have side powers. Ah, but you know kids these days. Yeah. Side ball. I, I've not seen that one, so I don't know what that one is. Uh, what's this? Ah, now here's Me something what? every young side cadet needs. Mental magnet. So it's still too high rank, so I can't get that. Now that Dowson Rod will help you find arrowheads that are buried deep. That's where all the really valuable ones are, you know. Find three or four deep deposits, and that baby pays for itself. It costs you money because it makes you money. Now, you take that side core there, put it together with nine side cards, and you'll have yourself a brand new side challenge marker, which is worth a whole rank, you know. Okay, that is the thing that I want, actually, so I'll, I'll buy one of those. Excellent choice! What else can I do you for? Now, you take that side card... No, no, don't tell me. ...dream fluffs. Delicious, nutritious, and cheap. Each one is packed with concentrated mental health. You shouldn't go anywhere without a pocket full of those. Yeah, cheap. 50 each. Yeah, right. 
And the dowsing rod is the one that... That's it for now. Yep. All right. Go get more airheads and come on back. Support your local merchants. <laughs> yeah, the stuff there's a bit pricey, but, you know, whatever. I need to get the dowsing rod because that will speed things up a bit. But that means running around and getting another 25 arrowheads and such. Hey, why are you stopping? Oh, I thought you stopped. No, 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 no. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Hey, you guys are good. Thanks, man. Hey, do you have a lighter? Because if you lit it and held it up right now, that would be rad. And completely insensitive to me and my issues. Oh, right, right. Oh, never mind. I forgot about the whole fire bad thing for a moment. Sorry, 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 my bad. Not to worry, my bro. Let's just pick it up from the part where I do that thing. <laughs> I'm just going to leave those two alone. That's the half of the band that Two broke over. up. Two, three, four. And then there's that kid over there who's invisible. He just runs away whenever you get close. See what I mean? But he's doing some... Oh, he's, he's drawing someone. Hey, Phoebe, can I oh, ask dear. you a question? Yeah, I'm, I'm not sticking around for them. I don't know. I just find them just slightly irritating, I suppose? No, that's not the word for it. Um... I just don't want to hang around them. I'm not sure why. Yep. Yep. Anyway, off into the woods to find the naked bear. Except I've never seen it, so I don't know where it is. Well, there's a ton of uh, arrowheads and things around here. Hey, you're that new kid, ain't you? Well, I'm doing some advanced training right now, as a matter of fact. So I don't think new kid is really a name that you want to get too used to saying. Hold on there. You're not doing Sasha Nine's advanced training that he does in his secret underground lab, are you? Hidden deep within the iron walls of the GPC, where no one can hear you screaming? Why, yes, I am. Sakes alive. Well, nice knowing you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure those two are the other two members of the band. Also, screaming. Hmm. That is something to... Oh, now what? Cutscene. Yay. It's the bear. It's the bear. Where is the bear? Hey, was that you? Looking at me? Maybe you should try getting over yourself? There were a lot of other people on that stage besides you. No, just now. In the woods. Hmm, <laughs> no. It must have been something else. You don't smell like pond scum. Nice. You should write greeting cards. There was some sort of shadowy being out there. Lurking. Watching. I know of only one creature who fits that description. It likes to hide in dark places, silently watching unsuspecting children from a distance. Really? Who? You, tree sitter! <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, that's the other half of the band. That wasn't a bear. At least I don't think it was. I don't know. Maybe it was, maybe it wasn't. Who can say? But this is another part that took me a bit of getting around. Because from that cutscene I was going into this area and just thinking, Oh, underground, it's got to be down at the bottom somewhere, but it's not. It's really not. I saw Nils peeking into a hole in the girl's cabin. I'm hiding. And I thought... Oh, Nils, when will you peek into the hole in my heart? Because you just see yourself staring back. Uh-huh. What? I mean, he'd see my new boyfriend, James, staring back. And he'd be furious at Nils. Who's Nils? Exactly! And anyway, there wouldn't even be a hole because James fills my heart till sometimes I think it's gonna explode. One time, I made someone's head explode. Well, okay. Maybe there's still a little hole. Actually, it happened four times. But James and I have each other now, and Nils is just gonna have to deal with it. Now they make me wear this special hat, so I don't have any more accidents. Are you even listening to me, Dogen? I hope so. Neither of them are listening to each other. Wow. So uh, she's obsessed with her ex-boyfriend and He's actually still hiding as part of the entire hide-and-seek thing that they ran away from earlier. 
Ooh, loads of stuff. Oops, fell off. No! Got it. Yeah. Oh, hello. A psychic bear. Okay. I'm not going anywhere near that. Oh. He's interested in me, though. Oh, that's the psychic ball, isn't it? Right. No, stop. Ah. You know what? I'm not going to try and scout around. I'm actually going to go straight into the lab. I've not played much past this point, so I'm just going to go. Yep, she's obsessed with nails. <laughs> This area confused me for a long, long time. Because I heard the crying and I was trying to figure out where it was coming from. And I was looking for the lab entrance as well and I thought it was down here somewhere, maybe in these rocks and stuff like that. But it was not, as it turned out. It was actually up here. I didn't even realise this for so long. Hey, who is that? Hang on, buddy. Give me a sec to pop this tin can. Thanks. I thought I was gonna have to eat my own arm. What is this thing? It's a GPC, a geodesic psychoisolation chamber. Oh, man. Cool. Cool? Do you have any idea what this does? Something cool? Uh, no. It's a six-sensory deprivation tank. A hermetically sealed metaphysical hotbox. It's solitary confinement for psychics. Nasty. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah, the staff hasn't put any kids in the GPC since the 50s. Bobby threw me in here. Bully and dwarf accomplice should assault own size or larger only. While in cooler, perhaps notice gigantic bear with skin where hair should be? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. Just so. Empty now. Good luck, small ones. Hey, wait! He's obsessed with the bears. With the bears. But yeah, th this Remember took up... To um, up oh. those scavenger hunt forms. We got a couple of big promotions for the winner. No, I'm not looking. Sorry. Is there a way into these ones, actually, now that I think about it? Nope, doesn't seem to be right. Anyway, I found him after about an hour wandering around here and around other places. And then I got up here and realized I didn't have the button anymore. Looks like one of the buttons is missing. Yeah. After you even getting this little prompt saying, hey, the button's missing. I couldn't do anything because I didn't know how to get into my inventory for so long. <laughs> Whereas it's just that. I don't want to crack open these Whoops. smelling salts unless I'm in a mental world. And I really want to get out. They smell pretty bad. Uh, hit the wrong thing because it responded to mouse. Okay. Button. Use it. That was so much faster. <laughs> and yeah. The entrance to the underground base is all the way at the top here. So I'm just going to drop into it. Agent 9, I'm here for the advanced training. Yeah, I, I like... Um, honestly, 9 is what sold me on this. I mean, basic braining was good. Don't get me wrong. So what are we going to learn? Oop. Bending spoons? Burning stuff? Oh, he's not answering, okay. Um, basic braining was a lot of fun, that's true, but it was actually seeing nine that made me want to decide to record this. That's what did it in the first in the first place. I've been hearing a lot about head explosion, and I was wondering. Science, Rasputin. That is what we practice down here, not parlor tricks. If you are serious about exploring the possibilities of your mind, step up to the brain tumbler, and we'll begin. Brain tumbler. 
Oh yeah, that's right. We don't quite get to see um, Nine's headspace yet, but that is so. What I, what what's this hair dryer thing do? So. Ah, you're ready for the brain tumbler. With this device, we will send you deep into your own psyche, where you should find unparalleled insight and power. Excellent. Tumble away. Now just relax. This will not hurt, unless something really very bad happens. Oh, that's reassuring. <laughs> Wow. Is this what the inside of my mind looks like? Not yet. You're still traveling to the astral plane. This is a tiny corner of what we call the collective unconscious, a place in which all of our unconscious minds are connected. You have just begun your training, Rasputin, so many of the connections with other minds are still not developed for you, and those doorways remain just out of reach. But the more you explore the mental world, the more connections you will form. Right now, the only unconscious world you can enter is that one, your own. Step through it, and we'll continue. 